All right, half and half not fans, uh, it's good to be back behind the mic again. I know I dropped a, a few videos over the weekend, but those are all kind of pre recording. Now, this is just a fresh video that I'm recording now. It, it felt good to unplug myself from like social media and whatnot. I went home, I think maybe Saturday afternoon and came back on Monday morning. I just felt, have you ever felt so overwhelmed by everything on your to-do list that you just need to step away from it all just to kind of recharge your batteries and come back stronger than ever? That That's where I am right now. Like I had a, uh, well, I wouldn't say a restful weekend because I was literally working on other projects while I was at home, whether it be looking through the storage building. Um, bringing out some more stuff to sell on eBay, which of course is a link to my eBay in the description below. Um, then I also took back home a lot of stuff that didn't sell on eBay. I tried multiple times to sell, but I just figured it would be best to say that stuff maybe a couple years down the road. But, you know, it was great to just talk a little bit about the haves and the have-nots because my mom, me and her, I already talked about the finale a bunch of times, theories. So, of course, I have several videos on the way, but... Uh, this video here is just a quick announcement for a couple of things. Number one, two weeks from today. It is 6 p.m. when I'm recording this on July 31st. So two weeks from, the, well, to be more specific, two weeks and three hours from the moment where I'm recording this video, we'll have The Road to Hell, which is the next new episode of The Haves and the Have Not. So two weeks from today, the uh, series returns. I'm probably going to do another reminder video next Tuesday and even the Tuesday after that when the episode comes on because I know you're probably thinking, Jeremy, well, this is just a filler video. You're, you're just trying to put more content on the channel to get more ad revenue. That's not really it. And this isn't to sound condescending, but I constantly get questions every day. When is the haves and the have nots coming back on? How many episodes are left in the season? Is the show ending in 2020? When is this loving you is wrong is coming back on own? Is it canceled? When is too close to home coming back on the air? So just a quick announcement video. And I'm pretty sure despite this video going up, I'm probably still going to get more people sending me questions. But, but hey, that's okay. That's what I'm here for. But again, two weeks from today, new episode of the haves and the have nots. I do not know how many episodes we're getting. Like, I don't know if the show is going to run from mid-August to the end of December. If I were to make an unofficial estimation, and I'm just theorizing here, my guess is that the show would be on from, you know, August 14th to maybe the middle or ending of October. Again, that's just a theory. I don't know. I'm just theorizing. My estimation would be sometime around October. That's just a guess. So maybe he'll surprise us and give us another three months. Oh, well, yeah, August, September. Yeah, that would be three months. But again, August 14th, new episode of the Haves and the Have Nots. So, folks, we got two weeks to hit my goal, short term goal. Can you help me hit this, um, make this channel hit 40,000 subscribers before then? We just hit over uh, 38,000, so I really think we can do it because it used to be a trend where uh, about maybe each week, five to seven days, we would get 1,000 subscribers. So go out there, share my videos around, tell people you know about the channel. Remember, let's try to get 40,000 before the episodes return on August 14th. 